No, I wanted to. I wanted to change written history as we knew it in the music business. I wanted to do something more than just be a guy who jumped around with a guitar on stage like a monkey, you know, and made a few bucks and played with some famous people. I wanted. This is something that you know. I'm hoping my son's kids, when he has kids, uh, will. This will be like the new. It's the new norm. It's we re, we we. We did the exhibit at the Smithsonian. I took a job at the Smithsonian before we made a film and told uh, Tim Johnson, the co-director at the Smithsonian, when he hired me about this, and he, he and I decided, let's do an exhibit on it. But when we did it, we didn't realize that how deep it was going to get and that we were going to change written history for, not just for Native American people, but for American history. You know, in, in the film, when Janie Hendrix, Jimi Hendrix's sister, says, you know, Jimmy was proud of his Cherokee heritage. And he was really proud of, of his black heritage. And then she says, this is the part I really like. She goes, he was really proud of his Scottish heritage. Because when she says that, it really dawns on you that what she was talking about was the development of the Americas, when all the different people from these other countries were coming here for a new life. And obviously the blacks, and maybe the Scottish, and the Indians were, were mistreated the worst, you know, but that's where all that stuff started happening. And, you know, we always assumed that uh, the Delta Blues was a black art form. I did. And not realizing that, you know, Charlie Patton was a straight-up Indian, you know, until Howlin' Wolf talked about it. And these things are stories that were never told. So you realize that it, it isn't a black story. It's a human story. Like David Frick says in the film from Rolling Stone magazine, it, it's not a black story. It's not an Indian story. It's a human story, and it's a story, really, of the development of North America with all these people that came here. And this music is a part of that story.